Hello, my name is Gary Greenfield with Greenfield Naturals, and we're here today to show how easy it is to install the hydro energizer into your home water supply system. Now, typically, your energizer is going to come into a, in a box like this, and you can remove the energizer and the detailed instruction sheet, which also accompanies it. Uh, the hydro energizer is approximately 21 inches long, weighs about 8 pounds. As you can see, this one comes with fittings on each end. They're shark bite fittings. These things work great. They're very simple to use. All we're going to require for installation is a marker, a pipe cutter, tape measure, and some pipe sandpaper. Okay, so the first thing we want to do after we take the unit out of the box, of course, is locate where we want to install the unit. Of course, uh, we turn off the water supply, and then we locate where we're going to put the unit. And we've, we measure the overall length of the unit, which I said was this one is 21 inches. They may vary just a bit, so you want to make sure you measure outside fitting to outside fitting, which is about 21 inches on this unit. And then we need to deduct 2 inches, 1 inch for each shark bite. So what we do, we'll take our, we'll, we'll locate our, where we're going to put the unit. We'll mark 19 inches on each side. And then we take our pipe cutter and we cut that length of pipe out of the system. After we do that, we simply mark, we'll take this, these represent each side. We want to mark one inch, one inch on each side. And the reason why we mark that pipe is to make sure that when we're pushing the unit onto the pipe that we're pushing all the way on. Okay, so we then take the unit and we push it onto the pipe all the way up until the mark is just just right there, just disappeared. Then we take the other side and we push it into place and we push it all the way in at the one inch mark and that's about it there. Now if you're hanging this, we want to make sure you use something to secure it to the ceiling or to the wall so we do supply zip ties with the unit should they be required. Uh, if it's placed on the ground, of course, you won't need those. Okay, so basically, that's, that's all it takes to install this unit onto your water supply if you're using PEX or copper. If you're using uh, PVC or galvanized, then there'll be uh, other type of fittings. Uh, the purpose of this video, of, of course, is to just show the general uh, requirements for installing this unit, which, as you can see, is very easy. So... That's it for today. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact us through uh, our website uh, via email or by our toll-free number, which is on the website at hydroenergizer.com. Thank you for listening.